I've been at four regionals, finished ninth three times at the Pacific Regionals and 17th once. The feeling of crossing the finish line, uh, knowing that you've put up the, the best time for that particular workout, that just, the emotions and the adrenaline it sends through the body is just unreal. If you go into a challenging workout, you can back off 5% effort and it still hurts like hell. It still hurts. But if you don't back off, if you continue pushing in that workout, it might hurt just that little bit extra, but it's gonna hurt a whole lot less at the end of the workout when you know that you, know, you, you, you gave your best effort. One of um, my favorite memories is actually my very first CrossFit Regionals in 2013. And I was competing against a lot of guys that I looked up to. I thought I might have done all right, but I definitely didn't think I would win that heat. But because I stuck to my, ga my game plan and, and yeah, gave my best effort, um, I did end up winning it. And it was just, uh, it, was, it was very special. Um, yeah. He's hitting the numbers we need, so hopefully in a couple of weeks' time we'll get some new PRs on his, on his deadlift and on his squat. Every single year, you know, the, the CrossFit field is becoming, uh, becoming stronger and stronger. You know, across Australia, I believe you've got something like 10,000 athletes. If you have one bad workout, you can accumulate a heap of points, and that just knocks you out of the, uh, you know, possibility of making regionals right then and there. So we're in like a, a peaking phase for his strength at the moment. Yep. So the reps are very low, so sets of two, sets of three, sets of four, things like that. Yep. And the, the load's are very high. Even though you have in the back of your mind what other athletes are lifting, I feel like you can't let it distract you. Because if you let it distract you, you're more likely to rush the process and try to uh, progress your strength lifts faster than you should do. Um, and that's a recipe for injury. You always have to find the sweet spot in training between how much volume you can tolerate uh, and recover from without driving yourself into the ground and injuring yourself. And that's a lesson I had to learn the hard way. Um, so in 2016, I basically missed out on regionals because my squat clean was too poor. It wasn't strong enough. And so then for the next 12 months, um, I knew that I had to obviously drive up all my strength numbers on the barbell. So I spent the next 12 months very focused on predominantly barbell strength work from you know back squats to front squats, clean snatches, deadlifts, and a lot of uh, assistance lifting as well. And I think I took it just a step too far. Uh, my, balanced, my, my training wasn't as balanced as it should have been. Uh, I wasn't looking after my, my recovery as well as I should have and it came back to bite me. Uh, my back became very aggravated, uh, so much so that uh, basically any barbell movement that I tried to do, there would, there would be times where it would just lock up and I would, you know, my back would be spasming and I'd be walking around like an old man for the next few days. Um, something which most people who have done some sort of weight training have experienced. And it's very frustrating when the very thing that you need to work on is the very thing that you can't do. 
Despite that, uh, I really did take a positive out of this year's CrossFit Open because uh, my body is much healthier than, than it has been over the last year. And so it means that uh, over the last few months, I, I've been able to get back on the barbell, which is really what I have to do to, again, drive up these strength numbers um, so that I qualify for regionals next year. Um, so yeah, it, it's, uh, it, was, it was frustrating, but at the same time, uh, almost a relief in the way that um, I now had a good, you know, 10, 11, 12 months before the next CrossFit Open for me to work on what I do need to work on and then hopefully I'll come back a stronger athlete than I ever have been. It works out better because then you get to get more recovery anyway. <gasps> Lifting will always be a major focus for me. Yeah. You know, right, right up until the open. Yeah.